Okay, you crank up your truck and this is what you see. Low pressure. Doesn't look right. You've got oil, you checked it, it's good. But you're not getting a good signal. You're not getting 30. Or a little between lower and upper parts of 30. So that's not good. So now we're gonna see if the oil sending unit is bad by these two simple checks. Okay, the first thing you gotta do is get underneath the chassis, find the oil filter, which is right there. There's the oil filter. Okay, and right next to it, you'll see the pipe that connects to the gauge itself. And inside the gauge is a wire. And we'll have to reach up in there, and I may block the view here, but you pull the wire out. Okay. There's the wire. So there's the wire there. Can you see that? That's the wire right there. Okay, that I just disconnected from this sender here. This is your oil gauge sender. Okay, and we're trying to find out if this is bad. So first thing we do, we disconnect that. Then we go back to the, cat, the chassis of the, inside the car, turn on the ignition and see if it pegs out the meter. If it pegs out the meter, then that means the uh, either your wire is cut or it's disconnected like this is right now. But it's showing you what your gauge would do if it's uh, disconnected or cut. So this is what it would look like. Now, if you can see that there, pegged out. So that would tell you either your wire is disconnected or cut. It's got a cut somewhere. It's been broken. So that's one sign. Now, the next test is the uh, grounding test. Okay. Make sure you securely ground a wire. Hopefully that's a good ground. And then you're gonna connect it to the connector up in there. And hopefully it'll stick in there. So you can go back into the cab and check it. And the meter should be pegged all the way to zero. Hope you're seeing this. So I have to do this at the same time with one hand. Okay, I think we're in there. I think we're in like Flint. Okay, there we go. We've got the grounding wire into the uh, the connector that goes to the sending oil sending unit. Okay, so now we'll go and check the gauge. Now the gauge, when I turn the ignition, should peg to zero. Get back on the gauge here. Now I've grounded it and it's gone straight to zero. So that right there tells me that my oil sending unit is bad. And that's it. The check's done.